of sure structure design construction and maintenance in this course we will cover all about offshore structure fixed offshore structures from a to z uh, an instructor dr mohammed ridi uh, have experience uh, 29 years in oil and gas projects i work with different uh, oil and gas company international like shell like um, bb uh, apache for some projects eni and uh, an instructor for many courses worldwide and some of my courses certified for Malaysia Institute of Civil Engineers. Uh, you can see our topics that we discuss about, I have three books on it. The first book of sure Stack, the same title. It will be published 2012. All about offshore structure from A to Z. All about from engineering, constructions, fabrications, repair, maintenance, integrity management system. Then the second book, it will be marine structural design calculation. I focus here about the calculation itself. And I have a chapter focus about sex software. How can we deal it? Which is the most one? Then I have uh, from 2019, I have the second edition for the offshore structures. I added some chapters, about, modified some uh, sub chapter according to as is condition, as there are some renovation on the codes and the standards, some updated, and also discuss chapter about pipeline, offshore pipelines. Our course outline will be as follows. The module, it will be uh, consist of 10 modules. Module 1, discuss about all the offshore structure and the project management for the offshore structure project and the main key or the main element for the fixed offshore structures. Then we go through according to module 2. Load affect the offshore structure. What about the load according to the live load, dead load, seismic, wind load, and so on? I know that the offshore structure, it is not uh, studied in the university or college and so on. So just I need for a new background from structure engineering, then I need you as a career switch if you need or need to enhance or your uh, professional development for the offshore structure. So I uh, just need the principle and then I built on it for our course online live course. So we'll discuss about all the type of the loads that affecting the structures. Uh, the first one, which is very dependent to each other, because the first one define who do what, what about the rules for the pipeline engineer, the piping engineer, the different type, where I can obtain the data, because for the offshore structure project, in most courses, in most cases, it will be an interfaces and integrity for many disciplines at the same time. So we need to know how can I obtain my data, how can I be confident for the data that will be obtained from different disciplines. Module 3, we go to through step by step how can you design about the tubular member, tubular joint, boot landing, riser guard, heli deck, and the another element that will be included on the offshore structure. The main element, it will be a module 4, which it will be one session. Every session, it will be from one, one hour and 30 minutes maximum. Okay, it can be increased if you have some discussion and so on. For the geotechnical design, all about the geotechnical, how can you implement the scope of fork for the offshore structure investigation? What, how can you interpret the data? What about the PY, TZ, uh, uh, QB uh, uh, deflection, and so on? And also discuss about the instability analysis and how can we design about the bias according to ABI RB2A. About the module five, we go through about the construction itself and discuss about the quality control. Because in some cases for the quality, for the construction itself, it depends on the engineering. There are interfaces between them and also the administration, like the lifting, the lifting analysis and so on. In this module five, it will be a seminar represents the sequence of construction, quality assurance, and the quality control. And how can you control this step? What about the main feature? Of it? What about the, the key? Or how can I manage it? Or the information that I need for the engineering and the installation later. Then we go through about module six, which is we focus here about the administration. We discuss about load out, 
launching, see fastening, and how can you make the about the launching for the jacket, for the top side, what about the administration step, all it will be presented by uh, literatures, by photos, by video, and so on. Integrity management, we discuss about the integrity management system for the fleet of the platform. What about the up-to-date structure integrity management system that will be issued for most oil and gas companies? And I need to highlight it here. We have for the integrity management, we discuss about the maintenance itself also, one of part. And how can we repair and have a case study of repair about the mess of repair, discuss about the underwater inspection, what about the type of underwater inspection, how can I make the scope of work for the underwater inspection, what about the code and standard if I need to go through bush of analysis, how can evaluate the existing structure. 50% of the project now worldwide, it will be for the brown field. That will be discussed due to the course. It will be brown field and the green field. And you will discuss together what's the difference between them and how can we manage the, the both. And once the knowledge we need to go to work for these two types of the projects. Then we'll go to about the lifting analysis, discuss about all the code and the stars are like DNV, German Schloid, about the ABI, how can I make analysis, how can I make design for the bad eye, for the sling, and so on. Then with your nine, it will be consist of the three session. Every session also, it will be one hour, one thirty minutes. It will be discussed about the, for this three session, overview about the sex. God just gave you a hand, how can you work with the sex software? Okay, so just I make open about it. How can we manage about the sex? How can we work on it? Just I give you a guideline and you by yourself or by the software if you have go through it and learn by yourself. If you need to make an advance it, we have module 10, which it consists of six sessions. Okay, so module 10, it will be six session because we have a case study for real project. We go to through it step by step. How can we design the platform from A to Z? You have you have the complete drawing for this project. You have the native file for the sex. We have everything to be with you if you need to go through some project to go direct to work on it. Also in this course, in addition to the course material, I give you papers, I give you uh, some uh, presentation, uh, video, anything it can help you, and also some spreadsheet, Excel sheet, if it can help you and assist you during the course. So it will be not just a course and goodbye. I will be your mentor even after the course, if you have any discussion and inquiry and so on, let us discuss together about it, I'll be happy. This course, it will be one-to-one. -one. It means only one on the course, because it will be tailored to you, so I make a, a questionnaire at the first, define what about the gap analysis, what you need, what's the module, it will be benefit for you, if you don't need to go to all these modules, and have a discussion and chat about it, to design about what about you need to achieve your goals and objective, what you need for your career and so on. As it will be in this scenario, first step I need to from the participant, I know about where is the time zone, where is your location because I make some courses from Nigeria, from Indonesia, from Malaysia, from USA for some courses. So the time zone, it will be different. So we need to manage between us, what about the time zone that you have? I have some questionnaire on the website. We have uh, some step defined about the modules and so on that you need, and also define about the time and the reasonable time to you and the dates. If you need to have a vacation, it will be Saturday, Friday. If you need a full day or just two hours per day, according to your capabilities and so on. Participant data and the knowledge that I need to follow, then set up the schedule and agree on the schedule between each other. It will be one to one because I know that everyone have its own objective. It is not like I don't to be like a normal course, five or ten person in the same. But in some time, if you have for the student, I have a group, so you can use LCD or TV, and I will make the course the same if you have some more than one person, no problem for it. But I prefer it will be one to one. 
because I need to make a check and make middle uh, first exam, middle exam, and the final exam. Thank you a lot for this. And sure, if you have an inquiry, we have this website www.readyman.com. This is what's up at any time. You can send me a message, and also this is an email. If you can send me at email at any time. Okay.